I mean, first of all, man, how do you feel? One, one, how do you feel being at this place right here, man? One, the seventh floor, the top of LA, man. How do you feel having your press conference here? You know what? I gotta start by saying thank you, Richard Schaefer. <laughs> Ring start. You know what? This is top of the line, man. This is high class. I was not expecting this. We are on the top floor, man. Look at this. This is um, this is really, really elegant. I like it. I was not expecting this. You know, I'm the main event in this card, and uh, I really gotta thank him. Mr. Al Heyman, everybody who made this possible. And uh, I'm really, really blessed and honored to, to be part of this. You know, you've been in the gym. I've been to see you, man. How anxious are you to get back in the ring? And is the layoff, or well, not the layoff, but the, the time in between, is it going to hurt or help you going into this fight? It might, it might hurt. We don't know. There's times, you know, you don't see it. Like, good example, my teammate, Mikey Garcia. He was off for, what, two years? Two and a half. Two and a half, bro. I didn't, honestly, I didn't see any ring rust whatsoever when he fought this last time. He, you know, he came back strong. Why? Because he was active. He was in the gym. He was sparring mostly every day. He's the kind of guy that likes to spar. That's the case in my side. You know, I've been training this whole year for a supposedly fight, you know, since March, April, June. Fight didn't go through. I was supposed to fight. To, well, not supposedly, but I got, I, I got word that I was supposed to fight in October. I was getting ready for that, too. So here we are now. December. It's done. It's sealed. Here we are, press conference, and I've been active, bro. I've been sparring, as you know. You've gone to the gym. I've been training. So, um, in reality, we've never left boxing. How do you feel about this fight? He called you out a long time ago, and at that point, you felt it wasn't justified for him to call you out. Now, he has the belt. How do you feel about this fight? Is it personal at all, Abner, or how do you look at this fight? No, I don't see it personal. I just see it like any other fight. It's a business. It's a fight. He's got a belt. He's a champion. I want to be champion. I want to be a four-time world champion and uh, I'm excited I'm, a, I'm excited to fight Jesus Cuellar and yeah, look at me man I'm top, I'm coming back against a top fighter knockout artist world champion bro I ain't scared of no one man this is this is sport not to be scared man I want to fight the best I want to showcase my talent and that's what you guys are going to see a new this is a new chapter for me this is a new chapter with the new coach I've been saying it over and over I know but I haven't had the chance yet to show you guys what I'm what uh, Robert Garcia has helped me with and you will see it come December 10th. Last question. There's another big fight in your division. Leo Santa Cruz me matching Frampton. One, what do you think about that fight? And two, you win this fight. Do you feel you're in a position to fight the winner of that fight? I think, I think uh, winning this fight I'll be in a position to fight anyone <laughs> in any weight class, you know? Just because um, this guy's, you know, he's a monster. He's a good fighter. He's the world champion. And again, I'm not fighting just anyone. So with that said, I think definitely, definitely we need to, uh, we, we have the privilege that we might have the honor to fight the winner of Frampton, Leo Santa Cruz, too. What do you think about that fight? Who wins it? Have you been in the ring with Leo? Um, it's a fight. We saw the first fight. It was a close fight. I thought definitely uh, Frampton won for sure. Close though, and um, styles make fights. So I think I think Frampton might have the edge because he won already. And not just that, he's a good, really good boxer. So I think Frampton, but I'm hoping that uh, Leo wins so I can fight him. And if not, I mean, Frampton is a good fight for me as well. Thank you, Abner. Always appreciate it. Good luck, man. Thank you, brother.